So this is the Kamal third gen engine LS. We are getting ready to actually install an LQ9 cam into this, taking this 5.3 cam out. That will help on the top end just a little bit more and give us just a little tad bit gain. And we had a spare LQ9, so it saved us money, you know? Everybody's about saving money. So let's go ahead and pull the factory cam out and hopefully no uh, cam balance come with it. So we turned the motor upside down to do this because the lifters can't hit the oil pan if the motor's upside down. And you don't need no fancy tools. As if you was uh, doing it straight up and down. Something don't want it to come out. You gotta keep spinning it as you take it out. It's gotta work its way around the lifter. Don't look at your cam bounds, Amos. I ain't gonna go for you. So you actually gonna check your cam balance? Don't look, Amos. I'll tell you that right now. That ain't too bad. That ain't as bad as yours? No. No, they look great, Jay. Okay. For real. Well, that's good. No brass. Have you been changed before? Is that the factory single? That's Man, the factory. That's factory. Yep. Good to go. I'm for sure look at it. You got a lot on your phone? Uh, yeah, I do got a lot on my phone. But it ain't on right now. There it is. Better view of the cam bearing and the lifters. As you can see, they're facing straight down. You can get a look at the cam bearings. Factory cam bearings. This is the LQ cam. We are getting ready to install it. Uh, this cam... I kind of donated him because uh, it came out on a 6.0. I'm not going to use it, so he's more than welcome to it. And he was like, I'll take it. Mm. Now, when it's on your cam, you want to keep it straight, keep it steady. Just take your time. And we went ahead and we lubed the cam up with some assembly lube. Turn over good? Mm-hmm. Well, that's good. So we do got to wait for a thrust uh, plate because uh, we ain't got one and it does need a basically replaced anyway because the gasket behind it was bad. Uh, we modded the oil pump, but we got to wait on the new timing chain. It seems stuff at a local parts store is never in stock for LS engine. So that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed this update on this Camel engine for the third gen Camel. Uh, let us know in the comment section if you ever installed a cam upside down too on AOS. I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching and subscribe.